Welcome to round two, Battle of the Cleaning Products. Last week, Clean Freak and Lysol tied in first, sending Veggie Wash home. Well, unfortunately, the people have spoken. Lysol could destroy your grout, so we're gonna send his ass home too. This week, we got new competitors. Dawn Power Wash, Easy Off Oven Cleaner, the heavyweight champion, vinegar and baking soda, and the most requested of all time, the pink stuff. Just a reminder, the grout looks like this, and it's supposed to look like this. First up the bat is last week's champ. Next is gonna be Dawn dish soap because we put that shit on everything. Next, we're gonna put this bad boy to the test. Next is gonna be the oven cleaner. I actually have high hopes for this one. <laughs> Next is vinegar and baking soda. I wanna let them sit for a couple minutes. It is time. Clean Freak, Dawn Power Wash. Oven cleaner actually did pretty good. The pink stuff didn't win. Sorry, forgot to click 60 seconds. This is for the chemical Karens and rude comments.
If your kids are filthy like mine, you need this in your life. Watch this. This is dried on strawberries. It's been drying all weekend. Spray, spray, spray. It's gone. All these were strawberries. blood stains in your sheets or mattress protectors i got you you only need two things hydrogen peroxide hydrogen peroxide and a toothbrush that's a hard work for me okay just put a little bit in there swirl it around get your brush and start scrubbing scrub your life away after a few seconds or a few minutes you will notice the stain gone at the end don't forget to wash it and you're done This is gonna be part three of why I don't eat at other people's house anymore. So like I said, I was munching and grunching on some SpaghettiOs, just getting crunchy and I'm like, what's this crunch? Where's all this crunch coming from? I was like, bruh, it's probably some expired SpaghettiOs, but let me finish this bowl so my friend don't feel bad. When I got to the end and there was only some soup left, I saw a half eaten spider. The same spiders that we had seen downstairs. My body? It started vibrating. I was shaking. I seized out. I think I passed out. This was not a good situation. I did have a phobia of spiders. I told my best friend, listen, babes, I love you. You know I love you, but this cannot go on no longer. I'm gonna have to go home. I felt like such a terrible friend, but I did call my mom and she came to get me and she took me home. I told her what happened and she was upset with my friend's grandma. From then on, we only had sleepovers at my house. And ever since my family found out about her living situation, we would go over there sometimes to help them clean. <music>